the tropics. So let's check in with Storm Team 2's meteorologist Ariel Hooley. Ariel, what's going on? Well, Deanne, we are officially past the peak of hurricane season, but it's still ongoing. It doesn't end till the end of November, and we have some more activity to tell you guys about. We're watching two waves of energy. One has about 40% chance of formation over the next five days. The other one has about 70% chance. We'll keep an eye on these. We do also have tropical depression number 11. Now, if this does become a tropical system, which it is expected to, its name would be Leslie. Now, we do have a wave that is moving off the African coast, and it is our next same storm that is Kirk and we're continuing to keep a close eye on it. Now it is expected to stay a tropical storm over the next couple of days as it continues to push off to the west heading towards the lesser Antilles by the middle to end of next week. So no threat uh, to the United States as of right now, but something we will of course keep an eye on for you guys. Now we do have some showers just offshore, not looking like they will push on shore tonight. We'll keep temperatures into the 80s over the next couple hours, eventually falling back into the 70s as we head into the overnight hours bottoming out in the mid 60s inland 70s as you head towards the coastline 64 a little bit chilly in King Street as you wake up 65 in Walterboro and I hope you enjoyed those comfortable dew points today because as we head into Sunday we start to creep them up just a little bit Monday and Tuesday going to be muggy and Deanne that humidity really moving back in for Wednesday it does come with some rain chances of a look at that 10 day forecast coming up Thanks, Ariel. And speaking of weather, today marks 29.